Okay, so we think there is a centipede under here because they saw it last night. And so we're not sure. They're probably scared his feet are going to get hit. I don't want it to bite me. And there's why are you wearing my shoes? I don't know why. Because I don't want to get... Hold on. I'll record, I'll record. Right, okay, okay. But what we're going to do is we're going to... We don't want to kill it. We just want to catch it but not get... It's on their bitten or whatever the heck they do. Get this, get you know, we don't want to get you on the there. carpet. Ready? Mm -hmm. Three, mm -hmm. two, one. I'm just kidding. Alright, one, two, three. Stop! <laughs> I want to go, okay. I want to, this time. I want to time. see it. One, one, two, three. Oh, it's dead. It killed it! Oh. It was suffocated. Thank you. What, no, what a natural way to die. What a natural way to die. I bet it was poison from bug spray stuff, anyways. Well, let's turn the guy, unless he's, unless he's joking. Oh, 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 I don't know if it's really. I don't know if it's really dead. It might have been pretending. Well, <laughs> Grandma! Centipede! Remember that story? Yeah. Natalie has a friend that was on a bus, and it was a huge centipede, maybe like this size, maybe bigger. And what happened, Natalie? His hat. He slept like out with like some. Food. It was in a guy's hat. And when he shook his hat out, the centipede came out. And he didn't know what to do, so he just tossed it on the ground. And, and so the centipede's some, going around on the bus, some old public Jean bus. Man, some old big Polynesian man yells, centipede! And they pulled the bus over, and everyone had to get off the bus. These are Hawaiian snakes. I don't know if that's a centipede. It's not really a snake. Yeah, it was a centipede. Yeah. It wasn't a millipede, it was a centipede. It was 100, not 1,000 feet. Wait, have you heard it? The story? Is it inside that thing in your hand right now? It's in here right now. Get rid of it! Did you, wait, wait, well, I want to tell you guys a joke. Have you heard it's this one before? Like it's out right now. What is... What is... What, what's, the, what's the joke? It goes something like this. What has... What's 100 feet but not an inch tall? It's, some, it's something like that. Yeah, oh what's 100 feet but not an inch tall? A centipede. I missed you so much. What'd you do today, homie? What'd you do? What'd you do today? I'm boogie boarding. Boogie boarding? In the rain? Lincoln's board got messed up on the reef. But my boy Maddie is fixing it. Rob, what are you thinking of your new board? You need a used board. This thing looks fun. It's like a really fun shape. It's really fun. Yeah. That's a cool single fit. Look at that thing. Alright, homie. Thank you. Thanks, bro. You're Appreciate it, man. man. <laughs> Later. Later. We gotta do it all over again. Did you take a picture? Yeah, but it was a video, so it didn't work oh out very well. <laughs> this makes me so happy for him. Like, I feel like if I was a dog, I would love this. What are you doing, dude? Oh. <laughs> Is that a papoose? It's cold. <laughs> hey, put your dad, do you wanna put those in here? Um, yeah, okay. Where do you want to go? Hurry up. So this is our Friday night dinner. We got nachos. What do we? Disgusting kind of cheese. What do we? A lot I like of real cheese. cheese. A lot of. It's a mochi. If you don't know what mochi is, you don't know what life is. Because mochi is life. Hey, uh -huh. Yo, yo, yo. Uh -huh. Is mochi life? Yes. You like that kind? Yes. <laughs> Bellie's going surfing. Hey, what's up? Richie here, Newsflash. If you're complaining about like news media and all the negative stories, start your own media company. <laughs> what? I can't do that. Dude, you already started your own media company. It's called social media. <laughs> and so the question of the day is, what's your story? What's today's story? And to you, you share consciously. And you gotta think about this. The news, I can't speak for all of them, but I would guess the majority of them have a hidden agenda and it's to push one story over another and it's to get ratings and people are paid a lot of money to do certain things. It's just, 
it's an industry. It's not like some benevolent program where they're just trying to do nice things to let everybody know what's going on. That's not the news on TV, guys. That might be your neighbor, but that's not the industry. We on social media are more than the few huge stations, channels, whatever you want to call them, that are pushing their own agendas. I'm just saying if all of us collectively start sharing our own personal, individual good stories, share our opinions, share things the way you want them to be shared. It's, I mean, it's all in this very moment, it's already happening, but it becomes an echo chamber where we see what's on TV and then we yell about it on the internet and then we start having fights in the kitchen, <laughs> right? With friends and family when they're over based on this whole cycle. That's the way they want it to be. I mean, they really do want us to see it and talk about it and talk about it more. It is what it is already happening. So the only thing at this point that I'm hoping you do is just to share consciously and you'll have a more enjoyable social media experience because you're getting something out of it instead of wasting your time. Others are getting something out of it instead of wasting their time. Because when you show up, I mean, are you wasting their time or are you helping them in some way? I hope that what I share is helping you. I don't really know. Do your thing, but I hope it is and I hope you do the same for others. You'll be happier, others will be happier and more than being happy, you might start changing some people's lives for good, influence them for good. All right, party people, ruckus list.